Boom Pal Zap in our search for the perfect frying pan. Come across the ninja, 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 <laughs> <laughs> ninja foodie never stick, which looks really nice. Looks I mean, like they claim it's like cast iron. It's like textured like, surface. Mm -hmm. It feels kind of like cast iron, uh, cast iron does. But it's not as heavy as cast iron. And I, I don't know what it is. It's optical illusion or whatever, but it always looks like somebody got hit with this frying pan, with the frying pans. I looked through the whole bunch at the store. I always got a dent on the sign. Shipping problems. <laughs> so we're going to do it just like our directions say. I've already washed the pan, soapy water, hand washed it. And this is how to do the perfect egg here, our directions. So I'm going to follow these directions and see if I can get it right. So far, we've yet to have the perfect egg on the perfect frying pan, but we're got high hopes for a search. Yeah. We've had the diamond and then the, the yeah. copper and the Gotham the steel. Yeah, Gotham steel. And the stack ones. That's a Gotham stackable. Whatever. Oh. Just hit a minute and a half. It's not sliding. I played with it a little bit. It doesn't look like, I'm not sure how non stick it's going to be without having to pry it up. Yeah, that doesn't look like it is. <laughs> every time every time now these pans tend to work really good with a very slight amount of some kind of type of non-stick spray or butter or oil but I yeah I don't think that's gonna be gonna work well, I've tried it a little bit more it's not it's not working for me. What we're going to do is we're going to start new with just a little tiny bit of butter or some kind of spray and see how well it works then. And I'm still scraping because it's still stuck. What I'll do is I'll wash this pan and get back to it. Good thing is it's super easy to clean. I'm just going to use a little pat of butter here right where I'm going to have the egg. Egg is on. And about a minute and a half on the egg. Just add a little bit of butter. <laughs> That's how it's supposed to go. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I think that's going to work out well. And final thoughts, it's like those other pans. You have to have a little tiny bit of something in there to keep it from sticking. But the texture is good. It's easy to clean up. Once you put a little bit in there, it's it'll float around like you see it on TV. Boom Pals out. Like, subscribe, comment, and share. We'll give a another video later on down the road about how they wear. Just a little bit of follow-up. Immediately after I cooked that other egg, I used the same amount of butter that was in the pan, and it's relatively non-stick for these scrambled eggs. So we'll leave it at that. It looks like a pretty decent pan. We'll find out over time.